welcome back. So today we are working on the S2000. Very exciting. <laughs> um, I have to replace the axle on the driver's side. Um, the boot has a tear in it, so definitely don't want that to heat up and then literally get grease everywhere. So we're replacing the whole axle today, as well as I picked up these Haasport differential mounts because my diff mounts are knocking really bad. Really bad, especially now that we um, replaced the motor mounts. It's a lot stiffer up there. Obviously, if you guys remember the last video, the motor mounts were in pieces. So now it's a lot stiffer, not moving around so much, and the diff mounts are just clunking. So finally, after like three weeks, my diff mounts have shown up, and we're gonna go ahead and do that today. So yeah, let's get started. So, both working on the S2000, we have the driver's side axle out, which is the one we're replacing today, and then all of the diff mount bolts are loosened, so I'm gonna get the jack, get ready to drop that diff down a little bit so you can pull the mounts out, and we should be good. So here are our original diff mounts. I just pulled them off. These are the front ones. And then this will be our replacement for the front ones. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these in. As you can see, a lot thicker than the original one is here. Um, they come with new bolts, so no big deal on that front. So this is the old one, a little crusty dusty. And here's our new one. Again, these are the 70 A's or whatever, so hopefully a little bit stiffer. to 
be a wrap for this video. I'm super stoked to have the new diff mounts in as well as the new axle in because I really don't want to deal with leaking grease at the track and having a whole track day ruined because of a small split in the axle boot. So I just want to take care of that now and I figured this was the perfect time seeing as we're already working back here at the back of the car. So yeah, I'm super stoked to have this all finished and wrapped up. And I think this will make a big difference for the drivability of the car. There's a lot of knocking in the back, especially now, like I mentioned, we did the front motor mounts. So I think this should be a big difference in the car's drivability, or at least I'm hoping so, because I've heard between these two things, it changes the car completely, meaning the diff mounts and the motor mounts. So. I will keep you guys updated with how the S2000 is driving and there's so much more to come. I have a big list of things I want to do to it and I'm super stoked to start checking off that list. So thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out and I will catch you in the next one.